Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. This week's grocery haul is a little bit different. Instead of going to Walmart and placing an order or fries or something like that, I went to Aldi and then stopped and grabbed like literally just a handful of things at Trader Joe's. So Jackson has a baseball tournament in Peoria this weekend, which is like an hour and 10 minutes from us. And so I plan on going to Costco. I know I mentioned that in my last grocery haul last week that I was gonna do Costco or Sam soon, but I held off last week until closer to the tournament so I could get snacks and things like that, like fresh fruit for the tournament, all that good stuff. So I plan on going to Costco or Sam's, not sure which one yet, on Thursday. So this is just some like random odds and ends. We needed more snack stuff and things for the kids' school lunches and a little bit of random produce. So at Aldi, I spent $100.62, and that includes the grocery bags I had to buy because I honestly wasn't even planning on going to Aldi. It was like super spur of the moment was driving by and I pulled in and then at Trader Joe's I spent 2674 so all of this is all the on the other side of the stove is Trader Joe's so we're gonna start down here I got some celery there is a like cold pasta salad I plan on making tomorrow to kind of meal prep for like the next few days um, and it calls for celery I thought I would try this shredded rotisserie chicken for a quick meal like for a quick thing like protein to add to my excuse me my lunches or my dinners cheese cubes for the kids we have some Hawaiian sweet rolls. I already have another package of these and I plan on making some sliders for the boys at the tournament. So I'm just gonna add meat and cheese to this and then take a bottle of like squeeze mayo and let them add like their own condiments to it. And then I plan on getting chips and Gatorade at like Costco or Sam's. We have peanut butter wafers, pop tarts, Hello Pandas. These are kind of like little smoked sausage sticks. This is mini brownies and mini confetti muffins, lunch meat. Croissants, I would have normally waited to get, well, I'm thinking of this really quickly. I would have normally waited to get lunch meat at Sam's or Costco, but like literally I use the last of it today. So I'm gonna need lunch meat for tomorrow. And then croissants I like to get at Costco, but there's so many of them. So I just grabbed this small one at Aldi since there's only six of them in there. The plain light Greek yogurt, or not, I don't even think it's Greek. It's just non-fat yogurt, right? Yeah, this plain yogurt is to make the dressing for the pasta salad I was talking about. We're gonna try these. I've never tried them before, but we have a cappuccino caramel drink mix. And then we also just have hazelnut coffee like cups. So I need more coffee. Another thing I'm gonna get at Sam's or Costco. I know I sound like a broken record, but I need some to get me by until then. A little thing of feta. We have red onions and cucumbers and then these little potatoes. These are the same brand as the ones I get at Costco and Sam's, the Tasteful Selections. I love these little potatoes. I use them all the time for meal prepping. I just like either chop them in half if they're small or quarter them if they're like this larger size. And then I toss them in olive oil and a bunch of seasonings and cook them at 400 for like usually like 30-ish minutes. Just kind of keep an eye on them and check on them. And I kind of just, you know, use my spatula and like flip them around every so often but love them so much mini chocolate chip cookies we have garbanzo beans sorry you guys i'm trying to not like rush a lot but i have to get the kids in a little bit so i want to get all of this put away before i go get them um because life like last week was insane i thought this would week would be a little bit more chill it's not it's just as insane, <laughs> if not worse actually egg whites and then i got pringles original and sour cream and onion these are just red seedless grapes don't remember if I said the chickpeas or not, and I've actually had three cups of coffee today, so I can't blame it on that, but chickpeas, bell peppers, and tomatoes. Another thing is I like to get my bell peppers and even like my tomatoes at Costco, but I want to meal prep this salad tomorrow morning, and like I said, I'm not, and tomorrow's Wednesday, and I'm not going to Costco till Thursday, so I bought the peppers. We have cosmic brownies. This is a pizza for dinner tonight for the kids. I have like a spaghetti squash like leftover thing I meal prepped that I'll be having, but I'm going to have pizza for the kids. Animal crackers, honey roasted peanuts, pretzels, two things of bananas because I plan on making banana bread muffins to take to the tournament for everyone, blueberries, and strawberries. So that is everything that I got at Aldi. Over here, we have just a few things at Trader Joe's. So I could not find lemons or fresh dill at Aldi. So that was kind of one of the reasons why I stopped by Trader Joe's on the way home. And then I saw these sour cream glazed donuts. These are like Aniston's favorite kind of donuts. I, she's never had the Trader Joe's version, but she loves like sour cream and like old fashioned type donuts. So I got these for the kids, figured they could have one for breakfast tomorrow and then one the next day. We have sliced black olives for that pasta salad recipe. These cookies are just so much fun. My kids love them. They're called these sprinkles walk into a sandwich cookie. So I grabbed those. Last time I was at Trader Joe's, I got these for the kids to try and these are freaking amazing. I even love these. So highly recommend these 10 out of 10. Um, the dark chocolate drizzled plantain chips. So I opened these and tried a couple and I think they're really good, but I'm not sure if my kids are going to like them. 
We have dill, I think Jackson will, but I don't know about Cohen and Aniston. We have fresh dill and a lemon, and then these are my favorite protein bars ever. They're bar be or bear bells, excuse me. I don't know if it's bear bells or bar bells, but they're so good, and they're either $1.99 each, or you can buy a case of 12 for $23.99 at Trader Joe's. So that is everything I got for the week. When I do my Costco or Sam's Club haul, wherever I decide to go, of course I will come home and film a haul for you guys, but like I said, I'm sorry this is so rushed. I'm just like, so crazy busy. So I'm going to get all this stuff put away, do some dishes and then go get the kids. So wish me luck. The rest of this week is just absolutely insane. We have something every day of the week. So hope you guys are having a fantastic week and I hope everybody is staying safe and healthy. Bye guys.